Welcome to the Fascia Center. Hi, I'm Dr. Bartels, and I am the owner and CEO of the Aphasia Center here in St. Petersburg, Florida. Intensive therapy is going to be a lot different than a traditional therapy schedule in that we are doing five hours at least of aphasia therapy a day versus only two hours per week. What we find is that we are able to take the problem that you guys are having or the goals that you're working on, and we're able to attack it from several different angles or several different types of evidence-based treatment. And each day you're seeing all of the clinicians. So everybody's got a slightly different approach, even though we're working on the same goals. Well, one of the big things we have are flexible scheduling so that we don't have a set four or eight week uh, unit that you have to fit into. It's time for real talk. I think some of the real challenges are mostly the emotional aspect. When you come down here and you're doing therapy every day, a couple hours a day, you're confronting your aphasia um, all the time instead of just being able to hide from it when you're not. <laughs> If what really matters to you is asking out that cute girl at church, then we work on scripts to help you do that. If what really matters to you is getting back to work, then we work on work terms. We work on work emails. We do reading and writing and speech and everything to focus on what really matters to you. I think the biggest reward for intensive therapy is watching improvement in clients' quality of life. Um, some examples of those would be clients saying or writing their name for the first time. Jason Campbell. What we want people to accomplish while they're here is not only a quality of life measurement, but things that are personal goals as far as returning to hobbies or being able to have conversations, do daily life activities. Real talk from Aphasia Center grads. I don't like it anymore. It's not good. It's terrible. Some of my friends um, think basically I don't know what is aphasia so I'm just going to run away. I'm not going to speak to me. And actually for me I would rather have a friend now who knows about me now because the friends that don't know before my stroke think I'm fine. If some of my friends don't want to speak to me, then you're not my friend anyway. One out here, I have a stroke. Going to Apisha Center, Annika has says, I hate it, I, I'm stupid. And Annika, says that June Afisha Center I was I couldn't say my name is Jason Campbell. I'm smart. You here you can do it. You can be inspired. Today is Thursday, March 10, 19. And I'm so happy. I'm so happy that I am alive. People, some people are kind of afraid on the first day that they're here, and then by the end of the day, um, they're laughing and having a good time and joking around and feeling very comfortable here. A lot of people. Don't blame it on the sunshine. Don't blame it on the moonlight. Don't blame it on the good times. Don't blame it on the boogie. Don't blame it on the sunshine. So why don't you smile when you say there is no there plateau? There is no plateau. All right. Take that, Thank, plateau. Thank you. Love you.